Welcome back to my channel. I'm Sarah, AKA Scarlet, and today I am doing a color spotlight on three new colors from Tressalure, and they are known as EL Euro Light Collection. So there are three of the colors. I'm wearing one on my head, and I have two more right here. And we are going to look at all three of these colors, what makes them different, what makes them similar, the color codes, the descriptions, and all that good stuff. So they are all in Beach Wave Magic. If you are interested in the Eurolight color collection, please stay tuned, hit that bell, subscribe to my channel, give me a thumbs up, and let's get started. The Eurolight collection from Tressalure is a new color collection, not new style, just new color. And they started out uh, putting this new color collection in with Beach Wave Magic. They are now expanding these colors to Picture Perfect, California Beach Waves. Um, and I'm, sh I'm assuming more styles will come out in the Eurolight collection soon as they're amping up with this new um, color collection. These colors are very dimensional very beautiful, a very um, popular. It's really what I believe ladies are looking for right now, which is dimensional color, um, rooted color, two out of the three are rooted, and I am really loving these Eurolight colors. So you will see the one I have on my head is my favorite of the three in the collection, which is 122028. And this color is described as a blend of light golden brown, with gold blonde highlights and a medium brown root. Now they put in all of the Euro light colors, they put more of the blonde up at the front in the fringe and coming down kind of like money pieces. And then a lot of dimension through the back, but not um, quite as bright or blonde as in the front. Let's take a look at this color outside and also in indoor uh, light bulb light. It's 1222R8 in natural light, outside light. It's really beautiful, really beautiful dimensional color. I would say it runs the neutral to warm, but there are some cool tones in it as well. So like, I feel like it's kind of neutral to warm with maybe just a hint of cool. So pretty. A little bit of a darker root than the next one we're gonna look at. And this is indoor fluorescent light, noting that it's always gonna be appearing a little bit darker, any color really, when you go into uh, light bulb fluorescent light with no natural light. She still looks gorgeous though. Such a pretty color. The next one I have on is EL1426R10. And this is the same color code as a very popular blonde that does not have the EL. And I did a little quick short video on the differences between the two. They're the same color combos, but the color is distributed differently. So on your regular uh, 1426 R10, the blonde is blended more, whereas with EL, the Euro Light, which is all about dimension, you have more of the blonde up front than you do on the regular, and you have less of it blended through the back to kind of give it more of a stark contrast. One thing I will say is I've had kind of a hard time deciphering or telling the difference between um, the 1222 R8 and 14, the EL 1422 R10, like they really do look kind of similar. But what I will say is that the rooting is a little bit lighter on the 14. And I would also say that the 1222 is a little darker. It's got a little bit more darkness going through it in the back, like a darker bronzer color. Even though you've got blended darker in the back here too, it's more golden. So the color description on EL 1426R10 is a warm red brunette blended with cool gold blonde and highlighted with gold blonde and a medium brown root. So the difference in those descriptions being that 1222.8 has a light golden brown versus a reddish brunette. 
And then 1222 does not have the additional gold blonde highlights. So I feel like this one is slightly lighter and a little bit more warm toned than 1222.8. So let's take a look at this beauty out in outdoor light. See it very blonde here. And I will show them side by side as well. So pretty. Roots a little bit lighter than the other color. And let's look at it in um, light bulb light too. Here is your indoor light bulb light. You can see it's a little more golden than 1222.8. Still a very similar blonde dimension, but a little more yellow, a little more golden. Our last color is definitely our lightest color, and it is the one unrooted color as well. And this is EL272588. It is described as a blend of light auburn. So you will see those, see that red, reddish color in there, that auburn. Blended with a gold blonde and platinum gold highlights. So it is definitely quite a bit lighter than the other two. There is still quite a bit of dimension going through it though with those three different blends. Let's take a look at it outside. This one is starkly blonder <laughs> than the others. A lot of, you definitely see that platinum going through there. And you can see that auburn when you see the Right here, those are the auburn pieces, and that's the platinum blended with the golden. I think my eyebrows are too dark for this color. Fluorescent light bulb light. Very pretty. You see some of that auburn down there on the ends as well. Okay, here is all three of them in natural light. And you will see that the one on the far right is our super light color, the unrooted. These two are our 1222.8 and our 1426.10, and they do look very similar. And I think that's, I'm trying to get, I think that's kind of the biggest thing is that there's, they're not a huge difference in these two. They both kind of have a, a reddish brownish base and a lot of dimension blending the lighter and the darker colors. I think when they're front facing, you can tell a little bit more their differences. Um, basically, but they are really similar. Basically that 1222.8 is a little bit darker, just a, sh you know, a shade darker and a little bit less golden. This is 14, this is 12. And of course, this little girl here looks completely different. There's no mistaking the differences on her. She is not rooted and she is much, much lighter in color. Hopefully you enjoyed this color spotlight on the Euro Collection colors from Tressalure. Hopefully it is helpful in making your buying decisions. As always, please subscribe to my channel, hit that bell, give me a thumbs up, leave me a comment, and I will see you at the next one.